All right, we're gonna put up the tent. We found this tent at the yard sale yesterday. We are gonna put it up. We meaning Melissa's gonna put it up. I'm gonna supervise. This is the bag. Armadillo by Walrus. Did you look it up? I can't find anything on it. Those tent poles look expensive. Well, they're not for like packing huh? or anything. They're not what? They're not like for packing or anything. That's no. Nice. Car camp. What's in there? Steaks? Oh. Uh oh. Oh yeah. Oh good pictures. Pictures. Casa Verde. Casa Verde. Is that what this model's called? Apparently. New for two thousand, so it's a twenty four year old tent. It's big, huh? Yeah. Is it? House of Salsa? What does House of Verde mean? Green. House of Green. It's a greenhouse. <laughs> all right. These are all the steaks. Oh, it's a tent and a screen porch all in one. Neato. I got it. No okay. smash your thumb. It is a weird shape, ain't it? The tent's not a weird shape, the pole configuration's weird. This is loose feeling. Oh, there we go. Alright, this is the part where we figure out whether the, all the poles are there. How many times have we done this, babe? They're all here. Melissa said they're all here. Those are some spendy poles, though, huh? Not Why are they? They're zigzag. It's Zigzaggy. Like Elastic's all worn out on them. 24 years old. 2004. Century, that's what happens. What's the gold one for? Probably the ring fly or else the doorway. We will find out. Wow, look, it actually holds up by itself. Somewhat. Sort of. Alright, it's starting to take shape, but it has this extra bar here. See? It has it shows it on here. But it doesn't really makes sense but I guess the orange one must come around here maybe this is this little bar right I guess well then it clips down so there it should go over there yeah so hmm. all right there it is holy mackerel babe this tent this is a nice tent but it's tricky it has it has these two poles it has two poles. I wonder why. Just extra strength? I think so. The asymmetry threw me off there. Nice job, eh? You can walk all the way through the tent. I like that pasture. Right? Yeah. It's got uh, lots of... Uh, now, you can't close off this screen porch, can you? There's well, no... I've got to put the rain fly on, so we'll see what covers, how it works. Okay. <laughs> nice work, babe. It. So the rainfly, so the rainfly is going to end up being like a porch too, right? Yeah. Holy cow! Holy cow! That is a nice tent. There you go. Does everybody concur? I don't know what those other I things are for. Probably for. I don't know what. That's a big old sun porch. I am a little concerned that 
if it was the rain, right? I mean, the, the rain's going to go through the porch, right? Yeah. So how is that? It's green, man. It's a, it's a bug fly. screen. Right. But, I mean, it's also the rain fly. That's how it's designed. Okay. I can't make it not be waterproof. I can't make it waterproof. So the porch would get wet, yeah. but... But there's a cover to right here, so yeah. the tent wouldn't get wet. Not much of it? Not much. It's got that nice field at the bottom. Other things are for. Wow. These loops, I think they're to tie down uh, tie with the with ropes. No, no, that's for holding this up. So it's probably got on the other side of it a uh, Yeah. yeah. Roll it up. Holy mackerel. Yeah, nice. Super cool. We can do one of these numbers. All right, that's it. All right, everybody. Here, we did it. We did the tent build. Fine. <laughs> See you later. Fine. All right, there's the bag, there's the tent and the fly, and the stakes, I don't know, this is the poles, the stakes, and the directions, directions and some extra tie down cordage is in here. Boom. It all fits in its bag. Ugh. You ain't gonna be backpacking with this baby.